Hey everyone, Tim here from Snap Attack. Let's dive into this week's threat snapshot on Certified. So this one is a little bit of a throwback. This vulnerability came out back in May and we've talked about it in some other snapshots but haven't directly featured it. So I think the snapshot was long overdue. Uh, to kind of quickly summarize what we're gonna be looking at today. So Certified is an Active Directory privilege escalation, meaning as a domain user, I can escalate to domain admin and really take over an entire Windows domain. Uh, like some of the other attacks that we've talked about, this one is going to leverage Active Directory certificate services, obviously as the name Certified implies, as well as Kerberos, which are both enabled by default in most Windows domains. And really here, um, again, just to kind of oversimplify this attack, what we're doing in this attack chain is we're going to um, have that domain user create a machine account, and that machine account is going to impersonate a domain controller. Uh, basically, we're going to change the DNS hostname attribute on that account, and with that, we're going to go ahead and request a certificate. Um, so that certificate is going to look like it's issued for the domain controller. We can then authenticate to Kerberos. It's going to issue a ticket for the domain controller. And from there, ta-da, we've got domain administrator. So um, let's dive in. Let's take a look what this looks like in our platform. Um, you can see here, this is what we consider threat intelligence. So we um, discuss a little bit and have a summary of what the article is. We'll link back to the original reference, and then we'll link to other content in our platform. So. We can see here we've got one session talking about Certified, as well as three analytics. Uh, definitely recommend you check out the original post um, by Oliver Lyak. Uh, this is a really great in-depth uh, article that describes the attack in detail, really talks through all of the steps, kind of the misconfigurations, and a lot of the science behind you know, why this, this vulnerability exists. Um, so definitely check it out. Um, also, we are going to be using his proof of concept that he released, um, Certify, today. And again, you can use this for your penetration tests, red teams, and just generally um, checking out security in your network against this threat. So let's take a look. This is the snapshot. Um, this is really the attack session, I should say, that we have in Snap Attack on Certified. And again, in this lab environment, we've got a Windows victim. Um, this is going to be our Active Directory domain controller. And we've got a Kali Linux attacker. Um, just kind of jumping around here, there's not really anything interesting that we're going to see happen on the domain controller. But let's actually take a look and see what's going to be going on here on the victim, or I should say on the attacker side. So a couple of different steps here. You're going to see that we've downloaded Certipi. Um, so we are going to um, enumerate some information about the domain. Um, this is going to get the certificate templates and all the information that it needs to actually launch this attack. Um, next step here, you're going to see we're going to uh, actually create that machine account. Um, and you can see here that we are um, trying to impersonate the domain controller DC1 at snapattack.labs. And then the next piece here is going to actually be requesting that uh, certificate here for that domain controller. So you'll see that actually gets created and saved. Um, we can then use that to, again, get a ticket granting ticket. This is part of that Kerberos authentication flow. And then when we have that Kerberos ticket, we can then go ahead and, and use that for other attacks. So again, this isn't part of the chain, but we're going to use mpacket and secrets dump. And you can see we just dumped all of the hashes in the account. So uh, pretty cool here. Again, four minutes and we've you know taken over the domain and launched the attack. Um, you can see here that there's quite a bit of detection activity here. Um, let's actually go ahead and take a look at some of these. So a couple of different analytics here. This one is looking for that machine account being created with a mismatched DNS host name. Um, like we mentioned here, um, the uh, victim machine is actually impersonating the domain controller. So in this case, you could take a look and see if there is that mismatch. Um, this is a pretty high confidence analytic. Uh, you can also look for the Kerberos ticket granting ticket being issued for a machine account, which again is likely going to be pretty rare here as well as the service ticket request. Um, all of these are valid. Uh, they were available for enterprise customers back when this was, uh, you know, this vulnerability was disclosed. So we make sure that they're always protected from the latest threats. Um, would also like to point out here that uh, Microsoft did issue a patch as part of the May 2022 security updates. So uh, if you wanna go ahead and update your systems, that would be a way to actually prevent this attack. But again, it's still good to have detections in place if 
you know, certain domain controllers or other things didn't get updated. So again, want to just talk through a couple of features of Snap Attack real quick. So like I mentioned, enterprise subscribers have access to this content and a lot more in the platform. Uh, they can go ahead and they can create and test their own detections. And you know, with one click, they can deploy an analytic such as this to their SIMs or EDRs. And then for many of our attacks, uh, they can actually launch an attack simulation and automate that in their network to actually validate that their controls and their deployed detections are actually working as expected. Uh, if you always want to stay up to date with the latest threats, definitely um, register for our free community edition. Lots of great content there. Uh, you can follow this threat snapshot series and be sure to like and subscribe. And we'll see you next week.